This video is to show you the internals of one of our ultimate fanless PCs. This model here has a DVD drive and an SSD drive installed. Uh, generally people these days aren't bothering with DVDs or Blu-ray and uh, this does mean that you can fit a second drive in place of the optical drive. When you do that we would fit um, an alternate front so instead of having aperture for the uh, DVD drive or Blu-ray drive it would be a solid piece of aluminium on the front so uh, nice and plain apart from the, the power button. Now uh, I haven't actually attached the data and power leads so I can take this tray out and show you inside. So here in the middle of the motherboard is the main processor and you can see these pipes, these three pipes and uh, they're called heat pipes and they transfer heat from the hottest part to the coolest part of the pipe so the heat transfers from the CPU down the pipe to the edges of the case. As you can see on the edge of the case uh, it is made of solid aluminium radiator grills, so they're basically great big heat sinks that dissipate the heat into the room. Uh, this works very effectively, in fact uh, just two of these heat pipes would work well enough to, uh, to keep the processor cool. Uh, but we have three heat pipes on the processor and then a heat pipe on the main motherboard's chipset, um, which is uh, quite crucial uh, because this is also um, quite a heat generator. Uh, more inferior products don't have heat pipes uh, on the chipset and they would need the, um, the product to have air cooling so somewhere in the product there would be um, slots that air can basically circulate through the centre of the case. This product doesn't need that because the, uh, the heat is actually being taken away down the heat pipe and to outside the case. So it does mean that the product is uh, effectively sealed from, um, from dust if you're in a dirty environment. On the underside are four feet. These are raised and have a rubber soft finish. 